Are you dead? Are you gone? I pay you. Well, what's up? Bandits attacked and ransacked my cart. Can you help me? Dude. My camp is nearby in the ruins of Nilheim. Get me there safely, and you'll be rewarded. I am also a little bit worried that this guy is just going to try and lead us into a bandit trap, right? So uh, let's go, dude. Let's, let's find out what's Close going now. on. I can see the camp. Really? This worries me. This worries me a Wait lot. Wait here. I'll be right back with your reward. Ah, uh, you're going to be. When you Looks say like my reward. You a bad time to get lost, friend. I knew this would happen. We'll just carry on burning. Continue burning. Carry on burning. All right. Maybe that burning wasn't quite so good. Oh, who are you? Let's change my weapon, shall we? Oh, that is racist. Maybe I should have a potion or two. I've just noticed that my healing is uh, a little bit down. And whilst we're fighting, let's do a bit of uh, frostbite venom. Awesome. More magic, just in case. And hit them. Oh. Oh, that was a waste. Uh, Warhammer, lockpicks, gold. Oh, the Warhammer was too much. Weapons. Let, let's... Ooh. Hunting bow of cowardice. Nah. Pickaxe, Staff of Flames. Let's use the Staff of Flames. On him. What's he got? I don't see him. There he is. Burn him, burn him. I seem to be a little bit too far away. <laughs> Literally just going to walk at him. Burning him. Alright. All good? We killed him. We did it, Lydia. Yeah. You took an arrow to your shoulder. Um, all right. Now, you can actually carry my stuff, can't you? I've got your back. Uh, I'd like to trade some I things. Your command. Yeah, you are. Um, so, weapons. What, what, what does she want? What does she want? She can have the hunting bow of cowardice. She have my pickaxe. She can have these arrows back, maybe? No, they're the best arrows. Let's use those. Uh, still dagger, still greatsword, still warhammer, woodcutter's axe. I don't know why I've got the woodcutter's axe on me. It's not as if I ever actually need to use it. Um, let's put the best stuff on I can and then pass it. Oh, no, wrong button. And then pass her everything else that I can. Um, so that. Uh, hi, give it over, give it over, give it over. Just, just take it all. Oh, no. Take that back. There we go, right. Um, I need to wear that. Mm, wear that. Okay, cool. So they're both the same. Well, I'm definitely going to wear that because it exposes my face. Um, okay, so that should be everything, right? You lead, I'll follow. Uh huh. That's how life works. Right, where is that guy that I just killed? You. Um, I'll take your money. That's all I want. Psh. Don't care about the rest of your stuff. So we've got an entire camp to, uh, to to raid out here. Right, nothing of any particular note there. Just gold and rubbish. Uh, bandit, we've done that. We've done him. We search this guy. Take it. Uh, take his gold. Uh, the him. Where was he gone? He deserves to be made an example of. How do we? Should we put him in the tree? Can we put him in the tree? That's the question. Go on, up, up you go. No, no, we we can't put him up in the tree. That's a shame. Um, where's this one up here? There was one up here that I caught. All right, no, she's got nothing on any value on her either. Maybe we should uh, hand this girl, this girl over to those uh, warriors that's looking for the Red Guard woman. That would be good, right? Sure. Then we could do, like, many deals and stuff. Right, I heard a man's voice there, and as I've got Lydia with me, I am wondering who, who that is. It's a little bit worrying. Um, Alright, so where am I supposed to go from here? This looks rather dead-endish. Oh, bandit. 
I don't, I don't want to face any more bandits. I don't want to face any more bandits. Lydia, you're going to get killed. Um, should we check it out? Should we just check it out? Oh, what's the worst that can happen, eh? What's the worst that could happen? I could find some robes. Man, it, he's noisy. Over that, or I'm noisy. I, sp I suppose technically I'm the one being noisy. Uh -huh. Here's the way up. Won't leave Skyrim alive. Well, I'm not. I appear to be completely hidden. What? Burning! Oh, Lydia! L Lydia! Seriously! What's up with you? Walking in front of me like that. Sure. Okay, right. Stuff, stuff. My throat feels a little dry. Right, it's time to have a drink. Have we got anything to drink? A potion of lasting potency, hey? Wow. Um... So, drinks. We're, we're going to look around and try and find something to drink in this godforsaken place. Uh, looking for an ale? Like, they're Nords. They must have ale around somewhere. Surely. What, I mean, what self-respecting bandit, let alone Nord, doesn't... Like, why can't I drink from this? Why can't I... Ooh, does this glow? Did that glow? I am or extra cold. We'll take that. Alright, what's up here? Nothing. What's up here? Nothing. Oh, chest. Uh, I don't know why I took those hide boots. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Alright, so we're over the bridge. We've got this guy to deal with again. Um, we're close now. I can see the camp. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's uh, take this on with Lydia this time. You and me, Lydia. We're going to go, uh, I don't know, fight him, really. Uh, the, the quest will be to fight him, but we need to take down the rest of the camp as well. Wait here. I'll be right back with you. See, that's... that's... Come on, Lydia, you can do it. We'll fight this one. If me and Lydia double team this girl here, we should get finished fairly quickly. Good work, Lydia. Wow. Worth her weight in gold, Lydia, I tell you. Right, now we'll go get this guy. You are a knob. Right, there should be another one somewhere. He's up there. Right, we, we, we won't check him. Right, so once again, I'm going to go around and collect all the gold. Because, um, you know, we need to collect all the gold. Um, and hopefully we'll be back to raiding that place over there for anything that it happens to have, which will probably just be drink. Let's uh, deep, deep pile these bodies. Uh, oh, oh, oh wow, his legs are in such a weird position, I thought there were two bodies there. Wow, Lydia, did you shoot him through the head? That's good, that's a good good shot. Uh, I am annoyed that I managed to just, like, what is in essence, jump off the side. Um, yeah, that's, de that's definitely not, not on par behaviour. Um, wow, that is a savage spike there, what happened to that? Right. So, we know we've got another character up here to go kill. Uh, and then we need to find our way back to Ivanstead because we seem to have got a little bit off piece here. Is... Do you reckon going around here? I don't, I'm, not, I'm not sure how we've lost it, to be honest. I am not sure how we've lost it. Maybe it was across the bridge. I, I don't know. Right, so we know that there up there is a, a bandit. And in here, no, in here... I have a staff of flames that I want to use. Aha! Uh -huh. So, with him coming down the, the stairs, we're just going to kind of sit here and wait. Are we? I don't know. He's No, he's not coming downstairs. Let's let's get up and chase him down. True Nords never back down. That's a bit silly. Why would you know? Oh, there he is. Surely, like, when you know you're going to die, that's the time to back down. Right? 
I mean, if you don't back down if you know you're going to die, then that's just silly. Right. Lydia. I've got your back. I'm sure you have, How but can, can you carry you my pain? stuff as well? There we go. Sweet. Lead on. All right, is this still one hand? This is a two-handed weapon. Okay, well, we'll try using this for a bit. I've, I've not really done much with two-hand... See, the problem with two-handed stuff is that I'm not I'm not set up with it, like, for my uh, skills and stuff. Um, but who knows? It might be good. might not be. We'll, we'll try to not jump over the side this time. Um, just jump up onto here. Because uh, I was trying to look over this side and go, ooh, that's pretty. Um... So I believe Ivanstead is over there somewhere. But I'm not going to swim across the lake because that's just silly. Why would I want to get that wet? Has this guy got any gold on him? Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. Now, what would be nice is if I had some sort of candlelight spell. Do you reckon I've got the candlelight spell anywhere? Um, whew. See, now, I, I kind of feel if we just went across there, we could get up quicker. But, as I say, this is this is silly. This this leads to uh, skin getting wet, and, and skin does not like getting wet. Right, so, let's quick save it, because we've uh, finished an area, and finishing an area is the point where it's definitely worth quick saving, because if I die through some stupid means, like, I don't know, falling off this bridge or something, uh, I will just end up having to do it all over again, and that would make me quite quite upset. Uh, it was quite upsetting, like, just jumping off the, the tower last time. But at least uh, I was just on the other side of the hill then, so that, that wasn't too bad. Uh, and next time, don't trust people on the side of the road saying they need help. Uh, like, I knew this would happen anyway, but still, it's not its not great, is it, guys? It's not great. Uh, I, I don't know. It, it leads me to not want to uh, to help people. And, and that's that's... That's horrible, you know. I mean, there's only the only true great virtue in this world is altruism. And if you're too scared to help people, then you, you're being you're, you're denying yourself the true true personal growth there, you know. So that looks like an interesting place. That's a farm, right? I kind of don't want to go up there, but I also kind of want to investigate that. What is that? Like seriously, what is that? Should we, should we go check it out? What's the worst that could happen? I keep saying that. I know what the worst that could happen is. I can die horrifically. Well, this is nice. Where does the water go? There's an awful lot of water flowing down into this dead end stream for it to not go anywhere. Fungus. All right. So, Lydia is still missing. I, I don't remember asking her to wait anywhere. Hmm, that's confusing. I might have to go back and find her. Um, might have to. Right. I don't really intend to... I don't really intend to uh, make a lot of trouble here. Hi, who are you? I'm a bit busy at the moment. What did you want? Are you an alchemist? I used to be. There isn't much time for that in my life anymore, I'm afraid. Why not? I actually owned a shop in Vivek City. Long ah, lovely ago. place. But I had to leave all that behind when the Red Mountain erupted. That was a while ago, wasn't it? Perhaps someday I'll reopen a shop here in Skyrim. I don't. I don't recognize your name. Oh, there's a lot of known roots. Actually, I'm growing it. If you hadn't noticed, I'm the only person alive that can cultivate Nern root from a seed to a fully grown plant. That is a skill, love. How? Yeah. How'd you do that? I had quite the mentor. He taught me everything he knew about the Nern root and its strange properties. I haven't seen him in many years. I wonder what became of him. Oh, he's not just like happens to be out here. Okay. Uh, do I have Nern root to sell? Honest pay for honest work. Do I? Oh wow, I got I got money for. Okay. Is it that obvious? I've got my hands full here. Have you? Between the farm chores, cultivating my supply of Nern root, and keeping a tight rein on my sister Adori, there's little time for rest. Why would you keep a tight rein on your sister? Uh, sounds terrible. Good luck with that. I don't need luck. I need rest. I will be back to help you, but right now I really want to finish work. off the. Oh, you've got a guard? Gray beards have summoned the Dragonborn to High Hrothgar. Such a thing has not happened. Hundreds of years. 
Uh -huh. Right, so it turns out that thing I could see was Nern Root. Um, all right, awesome. I'm not interested in Nern Root. I, I was kind of hoping that at some point we could, oh wow, look at this. I was kind of hoping at some point we could get something a little bit better, um, sort of Nern Root wise, get some of those ridiculous potions. Who are you? This place is boring. Nothing but the same thing every day. <sighs> wow, your voice does not match your face at all. Um, okay, so, going to see the Greybeards. What could I possibly learn from the Greybeards? Wow, this, this has been quite a run, guys. Um, I definitely feel like getting a... Uh, ooh, Kiva. Wow, that was quick. Uh, yeah, this is quite a run. I, I, I'm definitely feeling like I'm getting my adventures worth just, just from walking up this way. I mean, dealing with bandits, learning about Nern routes, meeting clandestine meetings of guards. Stormcloaks. If you know any true sons and daughters of Skyrim, tell them to head to Windhelm. Ulfric Stormcloak wants to see them. Well, I am a Kajit. I can hardly call myself a, a son or daughter of Skyrim. Um, I, I really am feeling... Oh, is that it? Is that it over there? The base of that mountain? Ah, oh, Perhaps you should swim? No, we're not going to swim. We never swim. Uh, running. Wow, this is a long way, guys. But, oh, another bunny rabbit. Ah. Oh. So I can hit him with just about everything apart from... <laughs> this massive axe. No, I can't, I can't hit a bunny rabbit with a massive axe. Well, we're just going to leave him over instead this way. We'll, we'll, we'll let that spider fight that bunny rabbit. I mean, why, why would we do anything else? I mean, look, we're not going to interject with actual like things that are already going down, are we? That really looked like a saber-toothed cat on the floor then for a moment. Good job that... Uh... Oh, what's going on over here? Yes. Hey, friend. It's good to see another merry soul enjoying this fine day. My name's Skin, not Mary. Ah, but you look tired. Come, share a bottle of hunting brew mead with me. Oh, please do. Yes, my friend. May your adventures find you fame and fortune. Yeah, let's do that. Um, and I'm getting out of here. What? Help! Who, who's what? Someone do something. What are we helping at? Oh well, that was a bit oh, look, stuff going on up there. Oh, and here. There's a lot of wolves there. How many revelers there were here. Right, let's go help this guy. I like that they preferentially come for me. This is this is fun. Uh how many other revelers are having trouble? Wow. Don't take him on, man. I mean, you've been doing well, don't get me wrong. Wow, one of your numbers dead. Uh, I'll take the brew from him. Charm necklace, yeah. Wow, raises my carrying capacity. That is more than a little bit of a fight. What, what about him? Hello? Hmm? Right, search the bodies. Right, we already searched him, and I don't see anybody else. There we go, bodies. So, what were those revelers about? I just kind of walked upon them. Um, they offered me some drinks and then started screaming before I could accept their offer. That's all a bit strange. Um, wow, okay. Well, hopefully, we're very near Ironstead. We, we've had a, a, a lot of thrills and spills upon the way. Um, a lot of random random meetings with random people that really randomly want to kill me. Ironstead this way. Wow. And death, doom and destruction is on its way. Um, well, I don't know whether it's actually on its way. Um, maybe I'm on my way. Um, Though I suppose that would also mean death, doom, and destruction are on the way. Um, I heard noises, but I don't see anything trying to 
kill me. No, maybe maybe we can make it across this bridge. In fact, we're not going to make it across this bridge because that is Ivanstead. And at this point in time, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. It's been an extended and eventful one. We've had a death, we've had some bandits, we've had some more bandits, and we have had some revelers that run away screaming rather than do anything. Like, they, they offered me mead and then died and I had to take the mead off their dead bodies. But yes, thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys, and I will see you next time. Bye!